welcome to Dean Dory. Yes, welcome. And what do you say, Nate? What? What? <laughs> <laughs> and Dory, why well, do usually you say hey hey? Hey. There you go. Yeah. We are happy to um, be with you today and happy to have you join us. Sorry, I'm a little ditzy today. Shouldn't I today? Mean, like it's a one-time thing? <laughs> stop, stop it. <laughs> Not as ditzy as usual then, okay? See, see how you're so more ditzy than usual. Oh yeah, see. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can get this done. Yeah. Okay, so we are all about thrifty sewing. Enjoying sewing, and we're glad you joined us, like I said earlier. So, no, nothing like repetition. So, yes, it's the mother of retention. Oh, that's true. It is. All I did right. not make that up. No, you did not. You can't quote me as saying that. Okay. Dory <laughs> said. Yeah, it doesn't work that. Yeah. It doesn't work. Hey, um, we, um, uh, first off, I have to apologize. My hair is wet. I had to come over and use my sister's shower because my shower is under repair. And it's been under repair for three days, so I wanted to take a shower. And we're glad she did. <laughs> I'm sure she didn't want to sit next to me if I had not. <laughs> <laughs> and you didn't want to see her if and she had. And you didn't want to see me if I did not. Yeah. So my hair's a little wet. It'll, it'll dry here in a minute. But the, the shower is almost completely repaired, so. Yes. Yeah. Yay. My husband did it. Yay. It kind of cool. He, he used some kind of uh, colors and tried to make it look like the floor was stone. Hmm. After he made the repair. After he made the repair. Okay, so did he have to take the entire shower pan out? No, but he had to take all the doors off the shower. So we have a, one of those semi-circle ones. Oh, okay. And so, like, you're going out, out in space or something. You're like in a space capsule. Yeah. Beam me up, Scotty. <laughs> anyway, um, <laughs> so he had to take all that glassware out and all yeah. the... And all the, um, the Hardware that goes with it to keep it the rail that keeps it. Yeah. Because we had to do the entire pan. You couldn't just do the bottom and look. They look terrible with the sides not done too. So. Oh. Yeah. So it was a big project. My bathroom is all tore up. <laughs> but tonight we're putting it back together. So good. Yay! Then you'll be Yay. able to use it. Yeah. Yeah. And he didn't have to tear the pan out though. That's the good thing. No, he did not. Yeah. I was thinking because at some point ours will probably do the same thing. Only ours is like a tub. But I have a walk-in shower, so ours was up is upstairs, and so it did cause a little bit. We could see a where oh, in the ceiling. Mm -hmm. So we had to tear the ceiling. Did and... you did you know it was cracked? Yes, but we didn't think it was oh cracked bad enough. Water will follow the course of least resistance. Wow, that's not even our saying. No, it's not. So let's go on. <laughs> anyway, let's, let's have all about our shower. Time. We're about sewing today. <laughs> oh yeah, let's need do our, our clean sewing. Like <laughs> what? We're about clean sewing. Oh, clean sewing. Yeah. We took shower. Okay, <laughs> let's have Nate do the drawing. Draw. Oh, oh. <laughs> throwing them all over the place. Okay, buddy, take one out. So this will be for our one of our future mates. What have we got there, Nader? Oh, he's opening it himself, too. He is. Yeah. <gasps> okay. What's it You say? hand it to Mom? Thank you. It says... Oh. Victorian. Something Victorian looking. Okay. All right. You could go lots of ways with that. You could. I'm yeah. thinking. Okay, Victorian. Yeah. Okie dokie. Yeah, I'm excited for that one. Uh, yeah, you, yes. I would be, and she would not be. <laughs> <laughs> it's so, okay. So let's start with an inspirational saying, shall we? Thank you, buddy, for doing that. Now we get this, we'll listen to Aunt Dory. <laughs> we have to listen to Aunt Dory. <laughs> okay, so this is from Malcolm Forbes. So Malcolm Forbes was, you've heard of Forbes magazine? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so he was the um, publisher of Forbes magazine. Was he the founder of it? His father was. His father was, okay. But he was the publisher. He's an American entrepreneur and politician, most prominently known as the publisher of Forbes magazine. Born in 1919, died at the age of 70 in 1990 of a heart attack. Here's something interesting about him. He was a collector of Harley Davidson's and specially shaped hot air balloons <laughs> and Fabergé eggs. Okay. What a variety, huh? What a variety. And I'm thinking, where do you keep 
the hot air balloons. I mean, like the real, the real ones that people use. And different shapes of them. So different shapes. Of, is that what you're talking about? I'm wondering, it's or is it just pretend? You know, like little porcelain ones. Hot air balloons. Yeah. So where do you keep them? Must have a big garage. They, he wasn't. <laughs> he was very rich. Yeah. He he actually he's he he's so rich that on his seventieth birthday. His birthday party was like two point five million dollars he spent on it. Every guest got a Rolex watch as a party favor. Wow. <laughs> he didn't invite me. I know. What was that? I know. <laughs> okay. Um, so here's his quote. <laughs> Too many people overvalue what they are not and undervalue what they are. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. I'm not going to say a whole lot about it, but that's a good thing. Yes. Good saying. We might comment a little bit more at the end on it. Well, like I said, today my brain's not working the way it should be. It's ditzy. Okay. <laughs> hey. Now, do you want to hang in here or do you want to go away for a little bit? You want to listen to us talking? Yeah. You do? Okay, then you need to sit up straight. Nice and straight. Good job. You too. All right, so today was our bell sleeve challenge. Bell sleeves. Bell sleeves, and I did a short version. And I did a long version. And she did a long version. That's and it. I think we're both happy with what we made. Yes, I am very happy with what I made. Yeah. I, I, and mine looks better on than it does off. Yeah, so let's let's hear about you. Okay, well, it's, it's <laughs> as I try to be as simple as possible, it's a learn to sew pattern from a call. Oh. <laughs> 7721. And actually, as I was putting this together, I mean, there's three pieces to it. Oh. One. Front, oh, bell, oh, four pieces. Front, back, and the then facing. The, the facing, or the, the neck, neck band, band, and then the sleeves. And as I was putting it together, I said, I was thinking, this is just like making a t-shirt. Actually, yeah. that's what it is. And it's a t-shirt fabric, isn't it? It is. It's, it was to be made out of jersey. Moderate stretch knits, cotton knits. Interlock French cherry. So this is um, um, jersey net of some sort. It almost looks like a flannel. It's not though. I and know, the, and this I, know. I got this fabric at um, one of the thrift stores here oh, a while ago. Sweet. So um, Mama. yeah, I really like it on. I think it gives it a dressy look with the sleeves. Nate said you got it at Walmart's. No, I did not get it at Walmart's. <laughs> <laughs> so I I really am happy with the way it turned out. Is the easy sew? Yeah. Um, yeah. It's just a jersey. It's like t-shirt fabric. Yeah. You know. Is. So this will be great to go shopping with in a little oh, yeah. kind of a little dressed up because of the bell sleeve. I did not want a long bell sleeve because they get in my way and that kind of. I yeah. Mean, for me, so um, this is the pattern I made. View C, and this has three different sleeve variations with it. The bodice is the same on all three of them, but the sleeve variations are, are different. One just has a ruffle attached to the drop armhole. Um, and then the other one, which is view D, which I did not make, has the sleeves are pleats in oh. there. There's two big pleats oh. in there, and then it's kind of cuffed. So, uh, but mine, mine is not. It's the bell sleeve. It's the one I made out of it. It's an easy make, and I may make it again. When I first, you know, like I said before I put it on, I was like, eh, not too thrilled with it. But it grew on you. But I like it. <clears throat> I like it the way it looks on me. And I made it in a size small. Good. Yeah, that's you what I did. You wouldn't have wanted it any larger. No, it said it was oversized, yeah. and, and it, it really is, is oversized, and so... Um, Let's see, the finish bust adjustment on this is um, measurement at bust line finish is 39. So that worked for me, you know. So, and, and because it was oversized, I, I wanted it to, I thought it would work. And it did. So, very anyway. Good. Yeah, very easy, just like what it says it is. And the back here, very easy. Not just easy, but very easy. Hey, hey. McCall's 7721. So, you want something simple that's easy to put together? Uh -huh. The only thing is when you lay out the fabric, you need to do, it had you do um, the salvages to the center to cut out the front oh. and back. And then... Oh, that's in a lot of these more... Well, more but you needed to do that to get the sleeve. 
laid out correctly mm -hmm. because the sleeve is, you know, it's big. It mm -hmm. takes a lot of fabric. Yeah. But it's easy, so give it a go if you like this, this look. Well, let's watch the review. Okay. Yes, he did. <laughs> did that look pretty on Mama? Aw, aren't you sweet? You're a sweet boy. <laughs> That's nice. Right, huh? Right? <laughs> Good. That's very nice. Okay, let's see what you made, Dory. I made New Look. New Look 6527. And I made New D. No, C. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I kept this. I kept doing that when I was doing it too. So C and D are the same except for D has, I think they have uh, this closed and they have lace or something over it. But the, but oh, the pattern is exact okay. same. Yeah. Okay. So they just did the, the yeah. bell sleeve just a little different. Just a little different, but it's, it's all the it's same. It's all pattern the same pieces. pattern pieces. Yeah. yeah. So. So I made C with the open bell. Get back here. Yeah. A, B, C, there is no C. A, B, oh, C and D. Yeah, there you go. She made that one down there. <laughs> and this was a very, very easy project. Also, I love that everything was hemmed before you put the sleeves in. Oh, nice. The, the bells were all hemmed. The, the bottom of it was all hemmed. Everything was hemmed. And I like this high. Um, yeah, that's cute on you. This high. Yeah, it, it does a good job because I think it doesn't make me look quite so, so busty. Chunky in the middle? Oh, busty in the yeah. top. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> so uh, wrong way. Chunky. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> so they did have say that I should do a one and a half inch um, top. top stitch around here, and I did it only one inch because I thought it would be good to catch the facing. Well, yeah. If I did one and a half, it would not be. Caught. It would be. That's odd. So I changed that little teeny detail. Yeah. On it. Very nice. That was it. Um, this fabric. I got in North Carolina from the lady who was downsizing. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I didn't even recognize that. Yeah. It's pretty fabric. Thank you. It's flowery and fun. So are you you think you'll wear it? I do. Yeah. 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 I do now, too. This one here, the finished measurement for this was a forty two in the bust, which would be way big enough for me. Mm -hmm. But it's a little tight. So I think it's running mm -hmm. a little bit smaller. Because I thought, oh, good, I'm going to have like, some extra room. I don't have any extra room. That's it. Yes. Yeah. I know how to get extra room. Okay. Lose weight. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I was thinking a really tight undergarment, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Spanx. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Yeah. So, um, yeah, it was it was not a hard to make at all. I actually really, really like this, this pattern. <laughs> and I would make this. I would make <laughs> this again, for sure. Yeah. yeah, it's cute. It turned out nice. I like your bell sleeve. I like the split in it. Yeah, that little detail dresses it up a lot. Yes, it does. Yeah, yeah. very nice. So um, this isn't one that had a question. No, this didn't have a question. <laughs> okay. <laughs> would you like to see it on me? I would. Let's see the yeah. reveal. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hey, hey. <laughs>
There you have it. All right. Very nice. It's nice it because, nice. you know, it's it's big enough around that it's not clinging to your stomach. Or, yeah. You know, and I do so. like the details, although it's hard to see in this fabric, but it does add to the overall yeah. look for it. Yeah, because like the sleeve, you, you make the sleeve here, up to here, and then you add this bell on it. I like that detail of yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. So. Very nice. Yeah. Thank so. you very much. You're very welcome. Well, that's our bell sleeve challenge. I guess, yeah. So we're kind of short and sweet today. Well, good. <laughs> I like okay. the sweet part. And don't forget, too many people overvalue no. what they are not and undervalue what they are. So this is talking about focusing on the positive, yeah. not the negative. Yeah. And that's what we all need to work uh, work on. Being joyful, being happy, and and you need to do that. Like we talked before, just the smile hey, hey. helps to change yes. the way you feel and the way other people hey, feel. Hey. And Nathan's hey, hey, and he's got the smile going there. So <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. so yeah. Um, it's very easy to get caught up on what we can't negative, do, yeah. what we're not, you know, and so we just need to change that. That, that focus. Thinking, that focus yeah. on what we Because we always can do more than we think we can. We There's always, can. yeah, you, yeah, you certainly yeah. can. Yeah. 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 So thank you so much for joining us this week. We hope you enjoyed our video and please uh, hit like. Yes, subscribe, forward, uh -uh. thumbs up. And um, put on the oh, notification. Wait. wait, 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 what? Would you like to see a make that somebody sent in? Oh, sure. I think that's a great idea. You forget that. We forget that almost. No, I intentionally waited until the end. Oh, okay. Sorry. It's a coming now. I have it right here. What? You know, I mentioned it to my sister at the beginning that I was going to do this. So it's how quickly things in your brain go. Hmm. How quickly do you forget? First I wanted to say, this is not a make, but we had uh, a, in our future makes um, something that said uh, making a pattern from the internet. Not a purchased pattern, but Correct. a free pattern. And so um, Margaret C. told us that there's a video that's called 13 free patterns you might be interested in sewing this winter. Oh, cool. I need to look that up. So I know you sent that to me. So yeah, but I thought it would be good. Maybe if you guys want to look at it. Oh sure. Um, Thirteen free patterns. You might be interested in sewing this winter. She said it includes apparel choices and a couple of bags. And the YouTuber name is the Southern Seamstress. So well, we'll have to take a look at that. Yes, we will. Thank you, Margaret, for sending us that Thank information. Thank you. And I do need to write that down. Yes. Yeah. Now we do have a make. <laughs> from uh, Leanne W. And she made this here. The whole thing? The, yes. The vest, the, the, the blouse, vest, and the, the blouse skirt. and the skirt. That's kind of Victorian. And she said it's all thrifted fabric. Oh, cool. The skirt was a sheet. Oh. No, the shirt was a sheet. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> they said with the same letter. It was the same letter. <laughs> the shirt was a sheet, the skirt was a curtain, and the vest was upholstery. Looky there. Even the zipper was th thrifted, and the buttons were thrifted. Cool, that's the way to do it. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, and she's from Iowa. Very, <laughs> very nice. So here are the patterns that she did use. She used Simplicity 8175 and McCall's 8398. Very nice. So, yeah, thank you so much for sharing that with us. Yes, we really, I like that. really appreciate that. And I know you guys like to see what other people are making, too. Yeah. Very nice. So, um, she did say on the Simplicity 8175, she made view C of the skirt. Okay. And then the vest and shirt combo came from the McCall's. Pastor. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. So, thank you for sending that to us. So, that makes me think. Up. Don't forget to send us your mates. That's right. Very nice. So, yes, we love to see them and we love to share with other people. Yeah, and I sew two at MEI.net. <laughs> I just had one moment myself. Yeah, almost <laughs> happened.
that one. Almost. So anyway, thank you so much. We don't need to go through all the other stuff that you just heard because we know you oh, you know what intently. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you'll get a snack in a minute. Nathan's all about the food. Okay. So we'll see you next time. Take care. Take Bye. care. Bye. 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 Eat. Eat.